ladies and gentlemen welcome to Kiaradice. if you haven't already please do subscribe join the tribe and follow me on instagram and other social medias that i might have that i probably don't post on i'm y'all know how i am about social media so I'm, I'm not the most consistent but whatever we're going to dhl to try to ship something internationally and it's really not, like nothing it's just shot glasses for my cousin and my dad but i put them in these like like <laughs> there are literally three shot glasses in each each package but i feel like i can't even take the chance and i feel like they're gonna make me open this or something so i'm gonna bring some extra you know i love my flamingos so i have flamingo packaging um and i have like a whole pack of those so i'm gonna bring two extra just in case and we'll just check the outfit afterwards we're going to the, our trainer i have four more sessions with my trainer and yeah let's head to dhl oh my god so i just got to the dhl just for it to be closed like closed for good not there anymore there was a um, <laughs> noodle place. So now I'm finding a local post office. Let's let's see. Oh my god, that was an interesting situation, but I was able to send one of the packages because it cost like 400 RMB. And I was like, all right, I'll just um, do the other one next time. And um, they said that like, because now I know there's like an app. I just have to, um, what's it called? I can have them come to my apartment and just take this. So I'll do that in a few days or something or next time I get paid. I don't know. So yeah, mission, mission halfway accomplished. Okay, now I'm in a bistro. This place is really cute. Um, I'm just gonna get a latte and a croissant and read for an hour and then go to my trainer up the street. Let's meet my trainer. He's so cute. Like, <laughs> he doesn't speak English, but he's learning. I will, I will show you him. Hold on. Uh, okay, thank you. Uh, come on, uh, first we'll open the air. Okay, 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 first we'll open the Oh, you wait, M H T M T H D. Ah. Okay. Good morning. It's now Tuesday, the twenty fourth. Um, it's like I don't know what time it is. Like ten thirty something. And I've got to get ready for my Chinese lesson. So basically, I take Chinese lessons with this girl that I met through Italki. And um, essentially, we just have like 30 minute conversations. I want to try to do it every day, but like obviously that doesn't work out. So right now I'm averaging of like three or four times a week. And just to keep my like, you know, I feel like Chinese is something or not just Chinese, but I think anything you do, you got to do it every day to like continue to get good at it or continue to improve and to maintain your ability. So I really just feel like I will never ever stop taking Chinese classes because I don't want to 
um, get to a point like how my Chinese was while I was in America, which was like extremely rusty, you know. And so anyway, and we just, you know, um, video call through WeChat. And she lives in Suzhou. Or does she live in Suzhou or does she just live somewhere in like Jiangsu province? I don't know. Not very far from Shanghai. And um, I pay her like, it's like 1,000... 1,000 RMB for 20 lessons and they're all 30 minutes so I think it's a it's kind of a steal honestly it ends up like that those that one package ends up lasting me like two months two three months so you know it's worth it and then I also um have Chinese lessons on Mondays with my through my job and that's kind of like a different style because we don't just converse. We, he like gives me an article and we read about it. And so we talk about like more in advanced topics. But um, anyway, in this lesson that I'm about to have, because this is the second time I've paid for a package, um, I said like a approach that I want to take is me describing movie and, and TV show plots to her. And, um, yeah, so, like, last week, we, I, th I think I had two lessons with her last week. Um, we, I explained to her the plot of The Terminator. <laughs> and, it, I, you know, I, I honestly did a pretty good job. I'm not going to lie. I, I was actually quite proud of myself. And, um, yeah, and The Terminator... I actually watched it because I had one of my students who's from Japan and he works in the semiconductor industry and his English is just so cute. Like he's adorable. He's very sweet. And um, he was describing, I feel like we were talking about AI and somehow hmm? somehow we got on the topic of the Terminator. And I had never seen that movie. Like, you know, it's a very popular film, but I've never seen any of them, which there are a lot of popular movies that I've never seen. Um, anyway, and so... Mm, he was doing his best to, to explain the plot to me. And what, like... I was like, oh, you know what? Let me go. Let me go watch this. Mm. So I watched the first. I watched the first two and a half. To be honest, I couldn't get through the third movie. Like, I I don't really like the franchise. To be honest, like it's just not for me. You know, it's just not for me. But the third movie is when I checked out. I was like, all right, I, I think I've seen enough. <laughs> like, I think I've seen enough. Okay, uh, great. Yeah. Um, yeah, so. Mm. And I've got to make sure I order lunch as soon as possible. So it can be here after because i got to be to work all the way across town by two o'clock. Um, they have me like teaching at a middle school. Can you believe that? But it's only like four hours, five hours a week. So like my, uh, Tuesdays and Wednesdays, Tuesday afternoon and Wednesday morning. Um, and this middle school is like a, a language school, right? And these students, their English is so good. I mean, I don't even know what to teach them. They're very intimidating. I actually looked at some of their artwork in the teacher's lounge. And I'm going to see if I can capture some of that on camera because it was just... I'm sorry for brushing my teeth. <laughs> it was just like so artistic and advanced and I'm like these are sixth graders that did this 
and I, I don't know I, I think these just are like really gifted students you know I'm not sure like how the average sixth grader in China is performing or like the work they're doing if, like but these sixth graders honey little geniuses so it's just like an oral English class like just kind of go there and talk to them but it's like large groups it's about like an average of 40 students per class so anyway thankfully each class is only 40 minutes today it's 40 minutes to two classes 80 minutes then out okay out and um yeah 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 so um then i'm going to go to the gym the new, I, i've got a membership at a new gym um this gym is like vip the gym i was going to before was raggedy it was really raggedy and i only went there because my friend numbing that's her gym and it's like a gym where like bodybuilders hang out so you see all these like super jacked dudes and they have these like obnoxious weights that they and they grunt and i'm like oh my god i hate that i just hate that i hate it and then they didn't have a clean bathroom and the facility was not even that clean i don't like that i need i need you know i need my things and now this gym that i I've, I've started i went i finally got a membership um last thursday today's tuesday they do the things they they do the things okay it's like it looks like a little bit like a hotel not gonna lie and i love that so and then also the gym that um no man was at was like it was like far away from me so it would take me like at least half an hour sometimes even 45 minutes to an hour to get there and I'm like this is just too much and like the whole point of me going there was to work out with her but she and I have such conflicting schedules that it's just it makes no sense so I found the gym really close to me you know like a 15 minute walk and fancier closer because I'm trying to position myself in the right places and I don't need no man who just spent all his time in the gym getting jacked his arms we know what that means when they over here they're compensating for something right right you catch my drift okay because why are your arms so big how the rest of your body work you can't tell me you ain't you ain't on the roids like you got to be on the roids some kind of roids and I don't need no man with no roids. Uh-uh. Okay, no bodybuilder is working in STEM and doing... Like, that's just not happening. So, I'm like, I'm trying to find me the men who who can spend a thousand RMB a month to get a gym membership. So, that's how we're positioning it. So, anyway. Let's go to my Chinese lesson, which I said is just going to be on, on WeChat. We just video, video call. Okay, so I just finished my Chinese lesson and... Unfortunately, I couldn't really record because my computer didn't charge. My computer is, is trash. I need to get a new one, but I that thing will have to like self-destruct for me to get another computer. Like, girl, be for real. I don't even use the computer. Only to watch movies. And um, anyways, um, what else? What else? What else? Uh, yeah, I told her the plot of like Legally Blonde. We only got through half halfway through the plot, and I think this is really a good method of study or speaking, like just talking about, like just describing the plot. Like I just go through the whole movie and explain, and some you know she gives me better. Work. I ordered lunch, waiting for that to come. I'm gonna get dressed, do my hair. Usually when I get dressed, um, first thing I do. Plug in my heat rollers, mm -hmm. and then uh, we're gonna head on over to that middle school. Oh, ciao, ciao. Whatever, 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 whatever. It's fine. It's it's fine. It's fine. Okay, it's fine. Uh, let me. 
me do my skincare routine. I've been like getting into skincare. Um, I'll show you what I use real quick. So this is like, um, I went to Watson's and they gave me, you know, something that's like beginner. So this is like a Japanese brand um, called Skin Advanced. And it just has like a, a toner, moisturizer, and a cleanser in here. So I'm going to like start with these three. And I what I recommend if you're for, if you're new to skincare, just get start with three toner, um, what was it? Cleanser, toner, moisturizer, and of course SPF. And so I'm gonna buy a new cleanser once this one runs out. And I just kind of put them all on one brush. Like I don't know if that's allowed. This brush. And yeah, and I also use some Bulgarian rose soap, just a bar soap. Like I love, I love roses. I love, I love them at all. You know, rose everything. And so, if something has like rose flavor or rose scented, I'm, I'm, I'm getting it. One thing is. A rose hates to see me coming. <laughs> like, I know a rose hates to see me coming. A rose scented thing. Like, look at my look at my wet wipes. Rose. Can I call you rose? My deodorant. Rose. Okay. It says Hokkaido rose. Oh my god, I love that. Okay, a rose hates to see me coming, child. Mm. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna just do that. I just put it all all three a squirt on here and i mean first i use my rose soap to you know wash my face and I'm, and i make sure like when i do this i put it all over my ears and my neck and a little bit of my chest you know and like the chin you know don't just be on the face like treat this sorry i'm running water treat this like like you see how from the a v-neck up is your face that's that's what i'm gonna say like keep that looking looking good and put the sunscreen well put sunscreen all over your body every day every single day um oh also my soap soap this is rose let's see it says um i love this this brand soap and glory um where is it? Oh, it says Rose and Bergamot, Dove Soap, Rose. It's all in Chinese, but it's, in Chinese, it's Mei Gui. Mei Gui is Rose. Yeah, needless to say, I don't play when it comes to roses. I love me some roses. All right, so I will check back in once I'm ready or once I'm eating or something. Yeah.
Okay, so it's Thursday, um, September 25th, 26th. I don't know, one of those days. Anyway, it's Thursday afternoon, and um, today is going to be my first day of working out using this new fitness app and going to my new gym. So, I'm going to let you all know how the workout went after. And, yeah, I'm just walking there. It's like 10, 15 minute walk. So, y'all, I just spent um, two and a half hours in the gym. And I had finished that, my first workout from that app. It took me that long, okay? Because, girl, I'll be taking me some breaks, okay? I'll just, They'd be like, oh, rest in between reps. I'm like, let me, I'm a rest in between or rest in between. I'm a, I'm a, <laughs> I'm a rest when I want to. How about that? Okay. So I did, I did it. I did it. Now we're heading home. I'm actually very proud of myself. And I think I'm going to come back tomorrow afternoon. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm gonna come tomorrow and then I gotta work. And I gotta work at the office and then I have a Pilates class. I'm looking on my chin. Yeah. Mm. So it's Friday, um, September 27th. Wow, September is just skirted on by, okay, without a care in the world. Um, and today I have, I just had my Chinese class. Um, I was telling her about the plot of Legally Blonde, which is called Lu Zheng Chao Jia Ren. <laughs> And we're almost done talking about that movie. And I've learned a lot of like cool phrases because, you know, I can describe things, but I think my um, ability to be more descriptive, I think actually I, that can improve in, in both languages, to be honest, you know. But um, yeah, and now we're gonna go get some lunch and then we're gonna go to the gym. Last night, I'm so proud of myself. I spent two and a half hours at the gym. And I um, finished this one, the first workout of that app I'm using. So now we're going to do the second one, which is all cardio, which is really, like, easy. So I don't, I don't know. I just want to get this workout out of the way because... Um, you have to complete the workout in order to unlock the next one. And so I think they do one day of like strength training or strength building and then another day of cardio. Yeah, so and then um, at four, I have to be at the office. And then at six, I have a Pilates class. And then... We're going to come back home and we're going to take this weave out. Okay, like this is the last day of this is why I'm wearing a turban. And um, ain't nobody got time. Like I cannot wait for this to come out. Like it's it's bad. I'm not even going to show you yet. I will show you guys when it's time to come out. And yeah, we can uh, we'll see how my real hair is looking. And tomorrow I think I'm going to do because I'm getting my hair done. I'm getting um keratin treatment i think i'm gonna do like a long thick bob like that's kind of the style that i'm seeing so we'll, we'll see how that turns out and yeah okay so let's go get some lunch I just got home from work. I'm very 
tired like i don't i don't know how what, whatever it's 5 30 and my pilates class starts at six and i'm just like i just came home to get the pilates socks and we're just gonna go okay no need to think don't think just go just do so um what was i gonna say i think i was gonna say something i need to take out my garbage and then head over there it's probably like a 15 minute walk and then we're gonna come back and get this weave out and i ordered food and the food is supposed to come between 7 20 and 7 30 7 20 7 40 7 30 7 20 and 7 40 I don't want to hear them getting here early. It's just going to be like, look, I ordered it for the specific time for a specific reason because my Pilates class is from 6 to 6.55, okay? And then I have to walk back here, which will be like 15 minutes. And I want food when I arrive. I want food upon arrival. I'm so hungry. I'm like, I can't eat and then do Pilates because I feel like I'm just going to feel, you know, like bloated or mm, overstuffed. So, so... We ordered and I want to have a big ass, big, big, big dinner. I got some like pasta, like pesto pasta with meatballs. And um, one of the, what was I going to say? One of the pasta types they have is called campanelle. And it's in Chinese, it's called like little bell, like bell pasta. And I was like, I don't know what that means, bell pasta. So I looked it up. Anyway, it's it looks like a shape of a bell. I don't think I've had that kind of pasta before, but let's see. So anyway, let's go put on our Pilates socks and some slip-on shoes and go do the Pilates and then come back. Hopefully have a lovely meal and then get attacking on this, <laughs> this situation. Okay, just finished Pilates. I I have opinions because I'm like, girl, the teacher, her body to me is is beautiful. Like she's very she's very thin, but like she, right when I was leaving, because I've had like this is my second class I've had with her. I really like this teacher, and she was like, oh my god, I'm so jealous of your body. I'm like, you're jealous of my body. I'm jealous of your body, and it just goes to show like. You have to love your body, like, regardless. So, I'm gonna stick with Pilates because Dita Von Tees does it. And I mean, whew, this girl at this Pilates place, man, she don't play. And her movements are just so graceful. I'm just very jealous of that. So, I will stick with it. This is your chance to win a trip. Let's get this thing out, okay it's I, I don't know can y'all see up in there it's it's just look at that look <laughs> i it all right let's get it out oh my god we just got to keep cutting this is a struggle we just gonna keep cutting cutting threads okay <laughs> it'll look better okay this is about i've been doing this for about 30 minutes i'm watching like kendra kendra g and trying to get this out so let's see oh my gosh okay got all the hair look at all this hair in the sink <laughs> oh my goodness okay now to get these braids out finally got this hair out it's like almost 11 o'clock and i still gotta wash it so 
I'm going to go wash it and then we'll be back. I whip my hair back and forth. I whip my hair back and forth. Don't let haters do me on my line. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Who remembers that song? You remember that song? Okay. Okay. I finished washing my hair a little bit. See, it's pretty long, actually. Wow. And now I'm going to just braid it. Put it in a few braids, like, or twists or something. And then, um, yeah, I'm done. And I need to clean my bathroom. So I'll see y'all tomorrow. We'll just check in when my whole keratin treatment is done. And y'all will see the results. Here's my hair straightened. I just put this back on and the clips because I didn't have anywhere else to put it. So, and I will come back in three weeks and get a keratin maintenance. She said that um, it'll take like a week for the keratin to set in. So, I just want my hair to be stronger, better, faster. I need to grow out my edges, like, I'm done with the wigs and the weaves for a moment. Hey y'all, so it's Sunday, I just um, got up, got dressed, going to the gym, and I need to go to the Apple store. But I just wanted to say something real quick and then close out this vlog. Um, I feel like I just realized that I am, I ain't gotta worry about nothing, I'm just, like, I, I'm just investing in myself. Like, I'm going to the gym. I don't know. Have y'all, can y'all see a difference? I don't know. Whatever. And one of my, all of my goals are based around me. <laughs> okay. So, since I just got this keratin treatment, I just put this in a little clip. Right? You're not supposed to, like, tie it up. So, I think a clip is okay. Um, and I, I cannot wear my hair down while I'm at the gym. Because, like, I sweat. I'm a sweater. I am a sweater. Okay, and um, anyway, so my new one of my new goals is I want like waist length hair in the next three years. Like I'm hoping by 2028, like my stuff is going down to here because right now it's like here, bra strap length. So I'm gonna be doing like all the treatments at the salon I went to yesterday. They do deep conditioning treatments, oil treatments. Uh, steam treatment, shampoo, detox. I'm doing all of them. All of them. All of them. Yep. Yeah, but I, like I said, I think I already, <laughs> um, what is it called? I already booked my appointment for three weeks from now. So, yeah, we, pff, we're about that life. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, and be sure to like this video and tell me something good in the comments. Okay. Love y'all. See you in the next one. Bye.